People across Northeast Wisconsin are voting in their spring primary elections. Various races for nonpartisan positions are happening across the region, including one in Menasha, where voters are picking a new mayor for the first time in 16 years. Two of the four candidates will advance to the April election following tonight's outcome. On the ballot are three city council members, Stan Sevenich, Rebecca Nichols, and Austin Hammond, plus one newcomer, Kyle Conan. Jason Zimmerman has been tracking the turnout. He's live in Menasha with Your Voice, Your Vote coverage. Jason. Brittany, turnout for this election is expected to vary because some people have a lot on their ballot and others have nothing at all because there is no statewide race today. Here in Menasha, there's a contested mayor's race should, which should drive a lot of voters out to the polls. High turnout for a February primary is typically when around 20% of eligible voters show up. This afternoon, I spoke to retiring mayor of Menasha, Don Merkus. He hasn't endorsed anybody in the primary, but tells me he will make an endorsement ahead of the April election. Mercus has served as the city's 40th mayor since 2008. During that time, the city's population grew by 18 percent, and he's especially proud of some of Menasha's new economic development, which includes one Menasha Center and the Bryn, which is an apartment and condo development replacing a building that was destroyed by fire back in 2018. It's a little different. Uh, I think the biggest thing is not being out campaigning. It's always really fun to go talk to people, learn about what they're thinking, what their families are doing, what, what's going on in the city from their perspectives. And I didn't get that this year because I wasn't out knocking on doors. Once the polls close at 8 o'clock, we will monitor the results and continue to bring you updates throughout the evening, both on air and online. Reporting live in Menasha, Jason Zimmerman, Action 2 News. Jason, thanks. Other primary elections happening today in northeast Wisconsin include two seats open for Brown County Board in the county's 6th district. The Green Bay City Council's 4th, 6th, 10th and 11th districts each have two open seats. In Winnebago County, the Circuit Court's first branch has two seats up for election. And in Nina, two seats are open for the City Council's first district as well as six school board seats. We are following these races and more in Northeast Wisconsin. We'll bring you results both on air and online at WBAY.com slash elections.